1983, Quiet Riot, fronted by Kevin Dubrow and Carlos Cavazzo, turned the music world into a rock and roll madhouse with their debut album, Metal Health. With Dubrow's banshee-like vocals and Cavazzo's eardrum-shattering chords, the band quickly seized platinum status with such monster hits as Come On, Feel the Noise and Bang Your Head. Now, in a devilish alliance with Moonstone Records, Quiet Riot unleashes their thunderous sound for Full Moon Entertainment's Doll Man vs. the Demonic Toys with their new album, Terrified. Actually, the band was first started by uh, Kevin Dubrow and Randy Rhodes, late Randy Rhodes, in uh, 75, and that band split up in 79. Kevin had gone through a bunch of different musicians, and I ended up playing with him in 19, February of 82. And then about uh, six months after that, we got the record deal for Metal Health. And the album came out in uh, March of 83, and here we are, the rest of this year. The songs we're doing for Dollman vs. the Demonic Toys, um, we're doing three Quiet Riot uh, composed tunes and two songs from Outside Writers. One song is called uh, Terrify, which I guess is going to be the song for the ending titles, and it's sort of a uh, Black Sabbath meets Van Halen heavy song, which we're real fond of. Um, another song is called Little Angel. It's an upbeat rocker co-written by the bass player of the suite, Steve Priest. Um, the Quiet Riot composed songs are a song I wrote called Dirty Lover, which is, the, I think, one of the most more bluesy, more of the bluesy songs that we've done in Quiet Riot. It features Carlos on slide guitar, which is um, something that we haven't had much of on our, our previous records. Um, a song called Rude Crude Mood, which is a basic heavy metal song about having a real bad day, and by the time 5 o'clock rolls around, you want to kill somebody. Let's start up the entertainment, boys. The last song is a song called Resurrection, written by Carlos Cavazzo, and it's the first uh, Quiet Ride instrumental that we've ever had. As a matter of fact, it's, it's really going to, I think, surprise a lot of people that it's not, um, it's not the Come On, Feel the Noise Quiet Ride. It's real, intense, dark, demonic. The positive thing about the recording process is that you can get real creative on stuff that uh, you wouldn't necessarily think about when you're performing live. Live is a more spontaneous medium. You can really be creative in ways you hadn't thought of before. Yeah, now Sabi Slide's wonderful, it's real rock and roll, yeah, but it was, but it was fit, fit in. Let's do it from the top. Uh, when I'm in there so long, I tend to get fatigued. Um, as long as I'm in there doing something, it's okay. But when, you're, when you've been sitting around waiting for somebody else to do their parts and stuff, it, I think anybody would tend to get tired. 25% working and playing and 75% waiting around. <laughs> I do like recording, though, because uh, it gives us a chance to fine-tune the songs. A lot of times they end up changing in the studio, and they get changed for the better. People called call us the original Headbangers only because uh, our first big single was uh, Bang Your Head. That was the title of it. And uh, I mean, we didn't coin the term. Actually, um, I, got, I heard the term the first time when Randy Rhodes returned from England after first touring with Ozzy Osbourne. He said, you wouldn't believe the kids in the audience, they, they come to the front of the stage with cardboard mock-ups of, of my guitar and they bang their heads. They call them Headbangers. I, went, I, I never heard of such a thing. And then. Um, Carl's this great song. The hockey mask is basically just an idea that the band had come up with, sort of a story of a guy who's gone so crazy he had to be put in a straitjacket and he had to put a metal mask on to prevent him from hurting his face, banging his head against the wall. We're big fans of the Full Moon films. Uh, we 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 like the demonic toys and the Transfers films, and we love subspecies. As a matter of fact, we know some ourselves. Met a few. As a matter of fact, you met the Quiet Riot crew. True subspecies. Terrified is now available on Moonstone Records. <laughs>